Now that the chairman of Changji Food Stuff is in custody and facing a long prison sentence over the recent edible oil scandal, attention turns to compensating victims. Employees, business associates and consumers are raw seeking redress. After the court ordered Zhang Ji chairman Gao Zhenli to be taken into custody, he's issued prisoner number 163 and put into a room with nine convicts. Aside from his poor sleep last night, his appetite and activities were normal. He also had some interaction with his cellmates. In order to prevent Gao from unloading his assets, early on prosecutors froze and garnished his personal holdings, estimated at three billion NT dollars along with Changji's ill-gotten revenues of 1.85 billion NT. Yesterday, the court fined the company 50 million NT for its blending of cheap oils and products labeled as premium and pure. The court considers it inappropriate to confiscate and allocate these assets. We will allow victims the opportunity to file a claim. A consumer's protection group has already recruited some 3,000 people to join a class action suit to be filed at the end of the month. About 18 million NT dollars will be used to cover pension and severance packages for workers. More than 30 channel distributors are also seeking millions in damages.